welcome back to our channel. Today we are back at Epcot, and this time we have another great dining review Yay. for you. <laughs> this will be our first time dining at Tutto Italia yeah, Ristorante. Ristorante. Yeah, it's an Italian pavilion in Epcot. Yeah, so we're excited about it. We can't wait to try all the delicious Italian food. We were at we were here for the art festival yes, on we Friday mm -hmm. and we ate that delicious ravioli. Yeah, that was that awesome. We had to yeah. come back for more Italian yeah. food. Make sure so. you check out that blog for the art <laughs> festival. It was really good. Yeah, so we decided to come back and do a dining review on this wonderful restaurant. <laughs> well, come along with us and let's mange, mange <laughs> on this Mag Taxi production. Restaurante. Restaurante. <laughs> <laughs> he says it better than me. It is so beautiful in here, guys. There's these beautiful chandeliers. You have this beautiful white uh, wine colored curtains. Beautiful portrait or painted portrait on the walls of Italy. Yeah, beautiful. I mean, it is very large in here. It is beautiful. Yeah. The ambiance is very calm. It is a little loud, but it's yeah. not as busy as it would be on a weekend because today is a Monday. Today is Martin Luther King Day. Yeah, and it right. is Martin Luther King Day, so it is really nice. It's beautiful, and we're just excited to try all the food and Oh, wine, so we can't wait. They also have Tutto Gusto Wine Cellar. It's like a little cozy wine bar that looks like a little wine cellar. Um, they have about 200 bottles of different kind of Italian wines. Plus they do have beer if you guys are not into wines. And they do offer small plates, menu of meats, cheeses, panini, pasta, and desserts. So they do have a touchless menu here. You can scan the QR code right here. And over here is the actual menu here. They have an all-day menu, kids menu, a dessert menu, beverage, and consumer information. Here we go. We have the antipasti here, the calamari, Caesar salad. Uh, it's a tomato and mozzarella salad. They have here wagyu beef. Oh, very nice. Uh, Torotino, which is a baked eggplant, prosciutto. Uh, this is the main ingredient. The main dishes here is pasta. They got some lasagna, spaghetti, fettuccine, gnocchi. Uh, ravioli and there's another menu here called the secondi you have uh, salmon you have a uh, new york strip steak you have a uh, chicken uh, breast uh, mozzarella parmesan uh, they have the manzo barasso which is a brave beef chuck rib with portobello mushroom ravioli Ooh, that sounds really good maybe magnus will get that uh, they got some wine flights here and here is the kids menu they have a choice of mozzarella sticks spaghetti and chicken tenders oh and a cheese or pepperoni pizza Kids love the pizza. And of course you have your beverage menu here. All different types of beverages here. Lots of wines, martinis, Sicilian iced tea, that sounds good. Now all the types of wines here, that's a beer. Right here, Bud Light, Blue Moons, and all the different types of uh, different types of wines here. And you can see the different prices. So lots of lots of wines to choose from here at Tuto. And we can't forget our desserts here. Uh, they have tiramisu, which is Magnus' favorite. They have a nice cannoli. They have a torta de ricotta and gelati sorbetti and a 50th celebration dessert. Really nice. So Magnus went ahead with the, uh, one of the three of the wine flights here. This is called From the Hills of, of Pianti. It's a, Pianti is the land of rolling hills uh, and fog, which is famous for the world's most friendly, food-friendly wines. The perfect aperitif white wine is followed by a juicy dolcetto and a dark Rustic Nivolio. So over here on the left, you have the Gavi, which is the Gavi Bastia Solo. In the middle, you have the Dolcetto, the Alba Bastia Solo. And on the right here is the Lange Nivolo Tierre de Bacao. A Bacao. <laughs> so this right. is the Gavi. Which are the Gavi versus the white one. Cheers. Cheers. Mm -hmm. So the Gavi is so good. It is, the wine is a little bit dry, but it's not super dry. And it has really good, great flavor. Yeah, that, mm. really good, right? Ooh, it's really good though, mm -hmm. I like this wine. And this one here is a dolcetto. Dolcetto. This is a red wine. Mm -hmm. Cheers. This is a little bit more bitter. Yeah, a little bit more bitter, yeah. More bitter, a little bit more dry. 
The third one here is a Neobolio. Cheers. Here. The last one. This one's also dry, but I like the color. It's a little brighter red. I think I like this one and the and the Gabi. So those are my two favorite. These are my favorites. Mm -hmm. Really good wines here. Now I went with the red passion here. Mm. This is Campari with uh, grapefruit juice. I and mean, look at the color on this. It guys. is a beautiful cocktail vein. Yeah, really nice. Really, really nice. Right, let's see if it tastes just as good. <laughs> Cheers, guys. Ooh, you get the sweetness in the end and the tartness of the grapefruit uh, in the, well, excuse me, let me reverse that. Sweetness in the beginning and the tartness of the grapefruit at the end. Really good. Is it a little bit sweet or is it more tart Both. than anything? It's like super sweet in the beginning and then and boom, then it hits you with the tartness of the grapefruit. The yeah, <laughs> really good and I love the color. So and would you say this is a dangerous yes, drink? Yes, it's, it's, it's a dangerous drink for me. Like I say, if you need to like, the sourness of the grapefruit. If you don't like the sourness of the grapefruit, you're not gonna like this drink. But it's definitely a red passion for me because I love, love grapefruit. Mm. Really good. Definitely recommend it. Mm. <laughs> now for bread service, they give you the ciabatta bread, two nice pieces of ciabatta bread, and you can dip it in beautiful olive oil here. Look at that. Mm -hmm. Nice olive oil. Uh, I love olive oil, I think, for mm -hmm. the two ciabatta breads. And they, in the package here, in this paper bag, is uh, breadsticks also here. Yeah, really, yeah, really nice, really nice. Now for appetizer, we got the Fior de Latte Caprici. It's a red and yellow grape tomato salad, Fior de Latte mozzarella, uh, balsamic emulsion, and Tuscan olive oil. As oh, you can see here, I love the colors. That looks so beautiful. And big, huge pieces huge of mozzarella piece here. of mozzarella there. Really good, look at mm, that. Mmm, yummy. <laughs> and we're gonna share a nice, beautiful dish here of calamari, uh, mar and it's called Mariana Picante, which is the hot, uh, the sauce here looks like it's picante, means it's hot. Mm -hmm. But look at the big chunks of fried. Oh my god, and they're huge here. and yeah. thick. Really nice. And a nice piece of lemon. Mm -hmm. Right there. Beautiful looking plate. Just to show you guys Ooh. how big these mozzarella balls are. <laughs> look at this. Look at that. Oh look at Magnus's hand compared to that. Look at that. It, right it looks like bottom. an egg. Yeah. <laughs> Let's put it over and, here. And we have the bite sized uh, yellow and, and Red tomatoes, Greek tomatoes, really nice. I'm gonna get a few of these. Mm -hmm. uh, ooh, I love that balsamic. You can see like, the, yeah, you can see it glisten here. Okay, let's Perfect. cut it there. Let's cut it to the, to the, to the mozzarella here. So I'm gonna get a big tomato. I'm gonna get a yellow one because I'm a big fan of the yellow ones. Look at that, guys. Very nice. How soft is the mozzarella? It melts away in your mouth. <laughs> and with the tomato, the yellow tomato, yeah. and the, and the, oh my god, so good. Really good, huh? I like the little vinaigrette yeah. flavor mm -hmm. also. Excellent Italian appetizer. Ooh, look at look this. At I'm gonna pour some of this picante sauce here on the side. Just a little bit. And then I'm gonna go ahead and take some of the calamari here. Nice and oh seasoned my there. Goodness. Mm -hmm. Yeah, very good. With some of the sauce there. Oh, that looks so good and so thick. Mmm. Mmm. The calamari is tender, crispy on the outside, and that sauce is a little, it gives a little hit, not too much, but it goes well with the calamari. And don't forget, we have a lemon here. Oh, yeah, let's squeeze, Can we squeeze that, that lemon. lemon. Look at that. There. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> oh, yeah. Uh, perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Yeah, I can't stress. If you love calamari, guys, with this sauce, it is excellent. Mm, it is magtastic. <laughs> and just here we can show the little the breasts that come in that little uh, little plastic pouch there. So oh, good. Mm, I can <laughs> Wow, look at how much cheese there is, guys. A little bit more, yeah. Perfect. Oh, oh wow. <laughs> and me being a plain Jane here. <laughs> no, I love my my, my spaghetti. It's spaghetti with beef, pork, meatballs, and uh, pom pomodoro sauce here, guys. And you saw how much cheese that's on they top of it. Yeah, oh, they that just looks put on so there. good, baby. Really good. It's a lot of spaghetti. Yeah, a lot of spaghetti. <laughs> I love a spaghetti. Man, they go with the manso brasato, which is a braised beef chuck, short rib, portobello mushroom, 
ravioli red wine sauce here. Mm. Look at that, guys. Look at that big chunk of, of uh, short rib they give you guys. Yeah, let me turn it And they this surround way. it with four big pieces of ravioli. So I'm going to kill the craving for more ravioli. Yeah, I guess the ravioli <laughs> that we had in the, in the, in art, the festival, art festival. And festival of the Arts. Really she loves, love. she loves the ravioli, the mushroom ravioli. Let's see how this one is. All right, so let's break Ooh, this up. Tender. Look at that, look at that tender. Tenderness of the that. short rib there, guys. The short rib. Now I'm gonna cut Boy, a little bit. I can smell bit. it from here. As soon as you cut into oh, it. Oh yeah, you smell oh, it. Oh wow, guys, I wish you can smell <laughs> this through, the, through your TVs or through your phones, man. It smells so good. Ooh, Ooh, look man. at that big That is a strong there. meat smell, wow. Look at that, guys. Mm. Go for it. <laughs> oh my god, guys. Oh my god, I have to take a minute to take all these flavors in. I can imagine. Oh, the ravioli comes across with that mushroom flavor, oh. truffle flavor, so delicious. It like melts in your mouth. Wow. The pasta on the ravioli is so tender and good, it's not hard. And then you get that delicious, a mixture of the short rib. The short rib, the beef is mm -hmm. so good. Oh my God. It's a perfect mixture of Italian with short rib. I've never had it like this. Pasta, yeah. This pasta is amazing, guys. If you guys are in this restaurant, this is a must. Wow. Let me take a nice, nice <laughs> serving of pasta here. Oh my that. goodness, look at that. That's a lot of spaghetti. Yeah. Look at that, guys. Ooh. Oh my goodness, mm -hmm. that is a lot. It's so good too. Look at that. Cheers. It looks so fresh and it smells so good. And let me, before I give you the the review on the pasta. Let me taste the spaghetti balls here. The meatballs, are, they mm. look so cute and little, but oh, <laughs> Ooh, it smells so good too. The meatballs, that beef, pork mixture, oh my God. And the, the spaghetti soft mixed with the, with the cheese that I got on there. I put a lot of cheese as you guys saw. The Parmesan cheese. And the sauce, oh my God. Only thing I wish they would, they were, instead of the four small meatballs, I wish they were the bigger fat meatballs, <laughs> like two fat meatballs. I have in prior, in prior restaurants, but it's delicious. Nice, the sauce, the meat, especially the meat of the meatballs ah. and the pasta. It's a great combination, guys. You can never go wrong with spaghetti meatballs. No, and, and it's you, a big portion. The portions portion here are big. big. Look, look yeah. at his portion. There's a lot of pasta here, guys. A lot of That's spaghetti. That's a lot of spaghetti. And look at mine's now here, too. Mm -hmm. That's a lot. That is a humongous portion of food here. The portions are big. You can never go wrong with spaghetti meatballs. That's my go-to. <laughs> and I think I mentioned there's four meatballs. There's actually six here. There were two hidden underneath. The, the, <laughs> mound, the big mound of pasta. So you actually get six smaller meatballs, but still a lot of meatballs for this nice big plate of pasta. So for dessert now, guys, I did get the torta de ricotta, which is a lemon ricotta cheesecake with uh, macerated berries here. As you can see here, guys, we go here and put it out here a little bit more. Look at tons of berries over this cheesecake, guys. Look at that, dripping over. And I like the portion, how, it, how, the, uh, how the cheesecake looks in that and that little uh, like cup kind of like a cupcake kind of cheesecake here. I don't know. It looks really nice. Yeah, the it berries looks beautiful. are all over. Now uh, Magnus got here the tiramisu. Uh, it says that it's the classic coffee flavored Italian uh, dessert, and it says that ours is created with the lady fingers. Oh, I can see the lady fingers in, in between the the cake right there, guys. You see yeah. that? Uh, dipped in coffee, layered with whip uh, whip mixture of egg, sugar and mascarpone cheese and top with fresh cocoa powder on the top oh there. Oh my god, look at the cocoa powder. Yeah, oh. lady fingers, yeah, look at that. It looks so good. Yeah, and a nice <laughs> big piece of uh, a tiramisu here. Yeah, really we got it. <laughs> yum, 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 yum. All right, so let's do it this way so you guys can see. Oh, I can see that's nice Ooh, and fluffy. it went right through there, yeah, right through. <laughs> look at this, how good. Woo! <laughs> 
good. I have nothing, no words. No words, huh? It's just so good. Yeah, is it, is it coffee tasty? No, the coffee does come across very good. Yeah. Kind of cheesy, too. Okay, yeah. That is, so, it's a mascarpone cheese. Coffee, cheesy, yeah. so it's not like super strong tiramisu yeah. like, I, like I've had in other restaurants. Yeah. Um, but the, between the cheesy flavor and the, and the coffee, oh, it's incredible. <laughs> now, let's go ahead and dip into this cheesecake here. That looks incredible Ooh. as well. Look at all those berries. Look at that, guys. Oh, oh that looks so creamy, babe. Oh, my gosh. Ooh. Let me try it out. So good. Cheers, guys. <laughs> oh, my God. It's like, <laughs> it's, like it's like butter. Bu it's like butter. <laughs> it's all cheesecake, you know? It's so soft. It's so fluffy and airy. Mm. Mm. How's the berries? It makes it the berry. Mm. I'm a loss for words. You're like me. I'm having a moment. <laughs> no, it's really good. Guys, guys. Let's, let's let him have his moment. <laughs> really good. The, the <laughs> cheesecake mixed with the berries here. And you can see how, how creamy. And soft, the cheesecake it, uh, uh, itself is so good. It looks amazing, mm. incredible. Mm. I tell you, the food here so far has been <laughs> magtastic, guys. Magtastic. I I'm so this. surprised that we've never been in here, babe, right? Excellent, excellent food. Definitely recommend this dessert also. Really good, magtastic. Now, Magnus, along with her tiramisu, she got a nice looking cappuccino, guys. You see there? Oh, look at, look at, look at the, the foam look on there. Look at the foam on there, guys. Really nice. Oh my God. This is how I like to to uh, end it, do end, it, end it end in an Italian awesome restaurant. Dinner, yeah. Look at this. With a nice cup of cappuccino. <sighs> yeah, it looks, so good. goes well with the hair tiramisu, right? <laughs> Great combination. Great combination. <laughs> well, guys, that was an amazing dinner. Oh my goodness. Oh my God. I thought good. the Italian restaurant. Uh, Mama Melrose, Mama Melrose was good in Hollywood, Studios, in Hollywood yeah. Studios. It was good. That was excellent. But, but this, this restaurant is, is great. This is magnastic. Yes. This actually blew that one off the wall. It was magnifico. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> the food, I mean, starting from the wine to the cocktail mm -hmm. to uh, the delicious, appetizers. The delicious, the calamari was excellent. Oh, my that goodness. tomato mozzarella salad was oh. Oh, that was fantastic. For. That <laughs> short rib for Magnus's with ravioli, the, her plate. Wow. I actually did kill my craving. Yeah. <laughs> and I helped her a little bit. <laughs> yeah, he had to help me a little bit because that, it was just so much short rib. Yeah, it was a lot it was of short rib. So ribs. good. Uh, my spaghetti meatballs, you saw, excellent. Magnus loved them also. She gave it to you. She, uh, she said it was great. Uh, yes. The meatball, right? The meatball the flavor. The meatballs had great flavor, and I love the spaghetti sauce. Mm -hmm. It's like very authentic. If yeah. it's not, not too saucy. Oh my God, not guys, too saucy. it tasted yeah. wonderful, wonderful to me. Uh, our desserts, my uh, the delicious ricotta cheesecake. Wow, that was like the, one the of the best that we've <laughs> had. Oh my God. And your tiramisu. And my tiramisu that had that cheese flavor mm -hmm. with the tiramisu, with the coffee tiramisu flavor. Oh my goodness. What a mix. It was so incredible. There is nothing negative that I can say no. about this restaurant. All the food tasted Other excellent. than it was magtastic. It was so great. And shout out to Micah, our server. Yes. Hello, Micah, if you're watching this. Great service, uh, always from Disney. Especially great service for you, Micah. Plus, plus, Hello. Micah. <laughs> um, but overall, Food was fantastic. The food was magtastic. Yes, yes, guys, it was so incredible. <laughs> Let me tell you guys, we're trying to get. So Paul and I, what we're doing, we've been trying to get to all the restaurants that we've never been to. In Epcot, that in Epcot in or in Disney in general. Yeah, yeah. So Especially this, Epcot. This was our first, very first time, and I've been living in Florida since 1989, and coming to Epcot, I've never been in this restaurant. Believe it or not. And this is Paul's first time too, and it was incredible. It was excellent. 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 Well, guys, if you enjoyed this video and found it, found it useful and delicious and tasty in any way, remember to like, share, and subscribe. subscribe. And guys, please follow our socials, follow our Instagram, uh, follow our our TikToks, Twitter, our, our, Twitter Facebook. our Facebook, all that. We like <laughs> we like to give our followers. Guys, today was a great day. Today was a fantastic day. day. Thank you all for much for watching. We'll see you guys on the next Mactastic Productions. Productions. Bye. Bye.